Well hey there everyone again welcome back to another tutorial. This will be part two of the movie theater. I hope that you all are enjoying this so far and if you are please leave a like. Now let's go ahead and get this started. Now let's go ahead and continue this on part two. So what we got here, right here on the front, we have this purple block here, which was the Magneta Terracotta. What we're going to do, guys, is we're just going to go ahead and take this all the way around and do another layer to make it three instead of just two. So again, just go ahead and take this here up another layer. And this will go around the entire build. So I'll just go ahead and come around this way. Now when you get to right here, or this, you're going to make this three also. So again, all the purple looking block here, we're just going to go ahead and take it on up another layer. Again here, just go ahead and come up. Now if you remember from part one, I told you all that we may move or change this area where it comes up to here and that's what we're going to do what we're going to do guys is we're just going to go ahead and wrap this around and also this will be three as well so this here will come all the way around this way and remember what we've done before we overhanged it by one and again it'll be three tall and it'll go all the way around this way all around the back and then it'll just go ahead and connect on up well, alright now once you have that all the way around the back and connected up to the front then now let's go ahead and come right over here to this arch we're gonna come to the back side of it and then we're gonna take the door right we're gonna come right here and we're going to place these right here like this. You're going to pretty much have one block in from here like this. You see it's one block. One block. And you're just going to carry this all the way down here. And you're going to come down like this again the same way. Having one block. Just like that. So it's going to be three, one, two across, two across, and then this. Two across, two across, one, and then three down. Alright, now once you've got that, then you're going to take this purple here. Alright? And this purple will come out one, two, three, four, making this five. So one, two, three, four, five right here. And you're just going to take this here back even with that. So again, this is two, three, four, five. And you're going to just take this arch, adding that all the way across. And then once you've got that, then you're going to take this door right. And this door right is going to come all the way back. We're not even going to count these blocks here because what we're going to do is coming over here, you're going to have your anisite half slab. Your roof is going to be on this level. All right, like this. And here as well. So this level. So to meet, meet all this up, take the polished anisite and you're going to make a wall like this and your half slab will come across this like that and then this will come across like this right on top of there so for this arch here what I was talking about you're gonna take this second you see how it meets up there
All right. Now, once you've got that section off, then this door right. When you get even with this here, this even, come back by one, two, three more blocks past this. All right. So again, just take this on down, all the way down past this by three blocks. All right. Now it should look something like this right here. Remember, if your door right is not white like this, then choose something else that looks similar to this. Now, if you're wondering how far down this purple went right here, if you remember, the half slabs here is on this level for the roof. So that would mean that this here would come down on this level here, which is six coming down here. That would also mean that this door right here would also come down even with that also. So go ahead and do it on both sides and fill that in. All right, now, once you've got that, then just go ahead and fill in this area here with this half slab on this level. And also on this other side, you would do the same thing with that half slab. All right, and once you've got that, then right up top of here, this half slab, anisite half slab, will also go on top of this polished anisite. And again, this here will be right here, all filled in. And then up here, once you've got that, then up here what you do is you'll have this here on this level as well. Like this, just like what we've done down there. And then right on top of here, You'll take the polished anisite up by two, just like before, and then this here on this level as well. And then you'll take this polished anisite. It'll also be two blocks, just like what we just done right over there. This here. So this here will come right on top of here. Again, two blocks tall on that. This anisite slab come on top of there. This here will be on this level. This will come up against there. And again, like what we just done over there, this here will be filled in as well. well Alright, now right in here, we're going to take the polished anisite. And this here will be filled in right in here. You gotta have one block from here like this. So just pretty much take this block and you're just gonna fill in this here. So fill that in there. Well, all right, now real quick, I'm gonna show you the layout of the inside. Now, if you don't get it exactly perfect this time, it's okay because we will go back later on Maybe in part three when we do the interior. Now I'm just going to show you the layout of everything before we fill in the roof and make it completely dark in here. So this is going to be very important to get this right. Now I'm going to be using a light source block. So glowstone or sea lanterns will work even. And also if it's already dark in here for you just use night vision. Alright so let's go ahead and show you exactly where I'm at. Where I'm going to be starting off counting at. So right here is the front. So come to the left side here. Now both sides will be the same, but we're going to be counting from this side going that way. So you need to be on this side here. So right here, inside of here, so this is the windows. We're going to come right over here to this corner. And from here going that away will be 23 blocks. This will be 23 blocks right here. So this will be number 24. This will be 24 right here. All right, now on this block, it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. This will be fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and nineteen. 
All right. So we just counted this stretch here. This was this was 19 right here. So 20 will be a doorway. This will be a closet. And then we're going to have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Number 7 will be a doorway. And right here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Another doorway here. And then from here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Alright. So that'll be the same over here as well. So right there is the windows come to this corner. So again, this way going this way here, this will be 23, this will be 24, and then it'll be the same numbers going this way here. All right, so now let's go back over here. Once you've got all that. Now right here where we counted the, this wall here. And this was 24. Turn this way again. So 1, 2, 3, 4. The fourth one is going to go this way. Two blocks. It's going to have one space here and two here. This here will be a closet. All right, the same thing on the other end as well. This over here, where we had this doorway, and make sure you guys mark where the doorways are going to be. That way, later on, it'll be much easier. So, come to the right of this first doorway right here. One, two, three. The fourth one here is going to be one, two, three, four, five. Turn this way here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This 8 will be a wall in between there. This is 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15 right here. This 15 will be a wall. Never mind the stairs. It's for later on. So this 15 will be a wall right through here. Dividing those closets as well. Alright. Now looking at it this way here. We just counted this. It's going to go up. And it will have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Turn this way. 1, 2, 3, 4. Alright. It's just another little area to go upstairs. Alright. Now this here will be the men's restroom. So let's go ahead and count that out. So right here is the windows once again. So let's come to this corner here. And right here we're going to be counting. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Number 10 is going to go in by 3 blocks. So this is 10, 11, 12, 13, and 14 14 blocks from that corner to here. Now inside of here you're going to have 1, 2, 3 blocks in between. And then you have these two here. Alright. Now right here where we have these three coming inside. You're going to have two blocks this way. And this is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6 right there. Now the women's restroom, which will be on this other side, will be the same. Just everything is going to be mirrored. I'm not going to recount all this, but I will look down at it like this here. You guys can pause the video right there if you need to. Alright. Easy enough. Now let's go ahead and move along here. Alright, so right here where we have this stretch on this wall here. Go ahead and count from here to here. So from here you're going to count 1, 2, 3 and so on. Now when you get to here, let's go ahead and count that. 
So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So there's going to be 18 blocks from here. So 18, this will be starting off. Make sure you, you mark all these. So this 18 blocks, and then you're going to, I'm going to start counting this one. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. All right. Then you're going to have two blocks here of space. This is going to be going into the food court. And then from here all the way down, I went ahead and pre-counted it. It's going to be 43 blocks. 43 blocks in between that door to this door. Again, this door here will be two blocks as well. And then again here the same as the other side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Alright. So now, let's go ahead and come right over here. Let's count from here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Number 6 here. Turn this way. You'll have this block. So let's get rid of these. So 6 here. You'll come in one, two, three, four. Turn it this way, and again the other side the same. So you have one, two, three, four, five here. All right. So from here going this way, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. Then you have the single block here. You turn this way. You have three. Go in. You have two. A single block. Two. Three. And then here you'll have one, two, three, four. And this block here, make sure you mark all these. It's very important. This will be your middle marker. Marked out, and we'll come back later on. This will be the middle marker here to this arch and also to the middle of the building. So make sure you mark all these blocks. This will be a, the middle marker, and to the left of it, one, two, three, four. And the same thing on this side. I'm going to look down at it. You can pause it there if you need it. It's going to be the same thing as what we just done there. And all the numbers are going to be the same coming from this side as well. All right, so now we once we have that, let's go ahead and do this here real quick. So again, right here, those are the windows. Here's the corner that we've been counting from here. So we're going to go on this side with the windows behind us. And we're going to be counting this. So right off of this corner, one, two, three. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. And then it's going to go up. So this is 8. So I'm going to be counting this block here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then you have 2. 1, 2. And then from here going to the right, you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Alright, now it'll be the same going down. So it'll be 2, 1, 2, and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So this would be 6 here. So I'm going to be counting this block. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. So this is 7 here. We'll get this bit in a second. So this is 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and 23, and 24. All right, so once you got that one, right above it, one, two, three, four, and five. So 
five blocks up and then this arch is going to be a little bit bigger so it's going to be two one two and then this would be one two three four five six seven eight nine number nine make sure you mark this again this will be a middle marker so mark it with something so this is nine 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17. All right, so again, this middle marker will be middle to this and also middle right here to the front of the building. All right, now here, this was 17, so they're going to come down 2, 1, 2, and then here is one, two, three, four, five, and six. So this is six. I'm going to start counting this one. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So this is seven right here. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and 23. Just like the other side. And then we're going to have this arch here. So it's going to be the same as the other side. So you'll come off of this wall here. So there's the window. you come off of this corner. And it's going to be coming this way. It's going to go up and over. Again, it's going to be the same. Alright. Now this little area here. And this little area here, this will be the ticket booth. So I'm going to count from this arch here. So again, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And this is here is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. Turn this way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And then it will go straight on back. We'll figure out the door for it later. And this ticket booth will be the same as the other one as well. Alright, almost done here guys with all the layout. So let's go ahead and come right over here. This side where we started counting everything at. So we have this long stretch here, but I pre-counted everything so it's okay. So right here we have the closet. And we're going to be coming off this closet here. Going this way. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. This would be 8 blocks right here. Okay? Alright, now right here, this is 8, so this is going to be 9, 10. I'm using the light gray wool for this. This is the doorway going down into the theater. And we'll get all that later. So 9, 10. Mark those. I'm going to re restart counting. So this would be 1. So right here, 1. Going to the right. It'll be 19. So 19 blocks. And then the doorway will be 20 and 21. Alright, and then we're going to restart counting here. So this will be 1, 2. It'll go all the way down. When you get to 12, right here being 12, mark this. This will be a wall separating the theaters. So mark it with a different colored block like I did here. So this will be 12. So 12, and then we're going to restart counting. So this will be 1, 2, and it'll go on down until you get to 11 now when you get 11 here you have another doorway so this will be 12 13 right here all right 12 and 13 there and then we're going to restart counting so this will be, again be one two it'll go on down to 16 all right and after that you have 17 and 18 for the doorway. 
All right, once again, we're going to restart counting here. So this will be one, two. It'll go on down, and you have another wall here, and it'll be the same. It'll be 12. So this will be the 12th block from there. So again, mark it. And then after that, it'll restart again. So one, two, and so on. It'll go on down. Again, 11. This here will be another doorway. And this will be 12 and 13. All right. So again, we're going to restart here. So one, it'll go on down to 16. And then 17 and 18 will be the doorway. 17, 18. All right. Again, we're going to restart here. So one, it'll go on down. Again, 12. So this, again, will be the 12th block for another wall separating. So again, mark it. So this will be 12. And we're going to restart. So one here, two, it'll go on down to 11. All right, so this here will be 12, 13, and to the right of that, starting off here, 1, it'll go on down to 19. So this will be 19, and this will be for the doorway, 20, 21. All right, and then... We're going to restart here. So this, it'll go on down. I'm not going to count this block here because this will go straight on down up against this wall. And then we'll have this closet just like the other side. Well, right now, as you see, there's going to be four movie theater rooms. So I have two here and then one on this end. We will be doing this one here. I'm going to show you how to do it. All four of them is going to be the same on everything. So what I'm going to go ahead and do, I'm going to go ahead, come right over here where we first started off counting. And what we're going to do is going to go inside of here. And we're just going to take a look at this. So get rid of that. So off of this wall here, we're going to have two blocks. And again, this is, this, what I'm going to show you is going to be even all the way down. All of it's going to connect up the same floor all the way to the other end. So again, this will be two. And this is the gray wool. So use something dark. And then I came down with a step with the granite slab. So again, use a dark half slab. And then I had one, two, three, four, five. And then another step down, and then one, two, three, four, five. Another step down, and then again, one, two, three, four, five again. Another step down, and again, one, two, three, four, and five. Another step down, and I'll count how many fives we have. One, two, three, four, five five and six so this one here is going to be six on this one let me count that again let me make sure one two three four five no 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 i counted this bottom block never mind so this will be five again and then another step down so one two three four five again they're all going to be fives and then another step down so from here it'll be a little bit of a stretch so I'm going to count this one after the step side here. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. So 25 blocks there. And all that will be filled in. And again, if we come to this end here. Uh, that was the first room. This is the second room. If you look at this, the floor will continue all the way across the same flooring here. And it will go on down 
up against this flooring here. Now I went ahead and done the partial of the wall here. It'll be black here. This is the black wool. And I'll show you everything else later. So again, the floor was just comes straight on across. So from that wall to that wall, let's go ahead and do the floor. And then later you can do the steps, the step downs and the chairs. All right. And the aisles as well too. So let's go ahead and, and uh, show you the aisles. The aisles is going to be right here where we mark the doorways. So each doorway will have an aisle. I use the prison ring bricks. So use something that's a little bit funky because theater is a little bit like that. It's going to be kind of dark in here anyway. So use something like that. And keep that in mind. So this block here, the aisle block, will be level with the floor starting out and then here we have the half slab so it's going to be two blocks there I'm going to go and count with this so two and then two with the half slab and then one two three four and then I'll come down two again one two three four come down two one two three four Come down two. It's gonna be the same all the way down. It's gonna be one, two, three, four, and come down two. It's gonna do that all the way down until you get to right here. Alright. So now let's go ahead and take a look at the uh chairs I used. You guys can use whatever chairs that you want. I use the jungle wood stairs. Now I what I've done with this is because we have this step down here where people can walk on this side. I turn the stair like this. See, so turn like this and I wrapped it around this way. And this stair will go all the way down. I'm not even going to count the stairs because the stair will start on this step side. And it will turn around on this one as well. Start here and turn around here. Start here and so on just like so. There are going to be one block in between of each other, like this, just like so. And we're going to have one, two, three. It'll go down, one, two, three. Again, it'll go by threes. One more time, it'll go down, three, and so on, as you see, just like this. Now, at the very end, I'm going to have an extra row. So it'll be one, two, three, four. So just go ahead and do that. Uh, on all of these here. Well, Alright, now once you have everything marked off and have everything where it's going to be at, let's go ahead and come down here and show you the screen itself. So if I come right down here where we first started counting off at, so this bottom floor here, you have one block back here. And this block here is the black concrete. Now this black concrete is going to be hard to see, so I'll mark it out with this glowstone. So it's going to come up by one, two, and three. And this wall will go all the way down. And then we'll have some steps. And then it'll repeat itself all the way down like that. Okay, so it's got that three there. It's going to be two blocks here that way you know it'll have a little space here so two blocks there and then around the screen itself will be black wool so down here it'll it'll have one block from here so this screen here I use the white concrete powder you can use whatever uh, on that so it'll be one block there two blocks there uh, we're gonna have one block from the top and then we're gonna have two blocks on this side right here okay so the actual screen itself whatever you guys use so I'm gonna be counting right here so one two going to the right it'll end up being 41 blocks and then counting from this going up it'll be 
20 blocks. So 41 across and 20 tall. All right. So once you've got that, let's look at the stairs here. Again, all I'm going to be the same. So again, we have this middle. We have this marker here for the wall. Very, very useful. So we're going to come down from this here. And right here where we have the screen, again, it'll be two. It'll just be a doorway right here. All right. Now this here will be one, two, three, four. And then it'll come down like this. I know it's kind of hard to see, so I'm trying to make it where you guys can see this. And then I use the purple stairs. You guys use whatever. It'll come by, by three just like so. Right now that you know where everything is going to be at, I am going to go ahead and fill in this roof here. And then for this second half, back half of the roof, remember the half slab here will be on this level. And this will go all the way down. I'm going to go ahead and fill this in. I don't like to build with night vision, but I'm going to have to because I'm just going to go ahead and fill all this in. This here will come around just like so in the back here. And I left plenty enough room back here behind the screens to make uh, all the redstone that we're going to need for later after this tutorial. I'm going to show you guys once again how to have a working screen. All right, now as you see, the roof is now completely filled in. Now let's go ahead and go on the inside. Now as much as I hate using the night vision potion, I'm going to have to use it. I just don't like all the particles. So on the inside of here, let's go ahead and look what I used. For the main entrance, I used the Magneta Glazed Terracotta lined with the white wool here. And I also used the cracked deep slate tiles here. Now some of you may not know that a lot of uh, buildings like this have some weird and colorful like flooring and walls so whatever you guys choose make sure that you use something that has some sort of pattern to it uh, it's all up to you on what blocks you use on the floor and the walls the only thing that's important is that you have everything sectioned off like I have so right here we have the warped slabs I have a step down right here is the white wool we're gonna have a step down here going into like a dining area so let's take a look at the women's restroom here on the flooring of this I use the lapis lazuli block and then right here we have the pink this is the pink terracotta now let's go ahead and count this real fast so right here is the three in between and from here to here is eight blocks looking down at it this is what it looks like here and then here is one two three four blocks there all right now I've done the same kind of thing right over here on the men's the only thing that I've done different is I chose a little bit different on the colors layout and everything's the same so right here again one two three four with the blue and then eight from here going across now for the flooring of this, I use the block of emeralds. And then going inside of here, I went ahead and done the bathroom. So here we have the two toilets that is the handicap toilet only. And then here are the regular toilets. Two upside down stairs like this. A birch trap door layer of snow a quartz block in the back with a button very simple here are some urinals urinals are really hard to do to make them look like urinals but it's minecraft here are the sink area here I got some in rods coming across and I haven't decided what I'm gonna really do the lighting in here but that's what I have so far and then we have the garbage cans and the hand dryers on the walls I use this uh, smooth sandstone 
and the chiseled quartz blocks on the women's it may be the same not sure yet but most likely also right here where this is this is going to be a wall so it's going to cover up all that it's going to be double walled so that's going to be real good as well this area here is going to be the main lobby and the waiting room and this here is where you get your tickets and again this here is going to be like the dining area here is the food court now in the food court I use the block of quartz inside of here and then right here we have a step up and I use the brown wool here you guys can use whatever blocks that you want and also I went ahead and put these walls up in between here and looky there I have a nice little scene and we'll get to that later on so here we have the black wool here separating where I have this red remember I told you to mark that out so the entire uh, room is going to be pretty much lined with this block and we'll do the ceiling later so we have this one here this one here all of them is going to be the same this one here and you guys can use whatever blocks you want on the screens all right now in here I'm going to use the snow block for the ceiling only because the snow block in this texture pack is very very bright white so what I'm going to do for the ceiling is I'm going to go ahead and place it right here right above the windows it'll be on that level it'll go all the way down and then it'll be on this level right here on the purple and then whenever you get to right here where this big window is you're gonna put it on this black so it's gonna come up like this right on that black all the way across it'll come down like this here and then it'll come right here above these windows as well just like this so go ahead and take whatever block you're gonna use on the ceiling and again guys whatever blocks you guys use during this entire build please list it down below it may help others out so this ceiling in here may be different and this is a wall divider here so this here is just gonna simply come across like this so just go ahead and do that and fill in your roof your your ceiling inside of here well, right now you're probably wondering how far back this right here comes it's going to pretty much all this archway you're going to take it all the way back to where this wall is so all this right here that comes up over this window all every bit of this here is going to come straight on back all right now once your ceiling is like this right here then now let's go ahead and come right over here and take a look at this i use the red wool for my walls and I use the red sandstone for a bottom border again whatever blocks you use is up to you now on my windows here I used the light blue terracotta and the blue concrete powder right here in the middle I have a dark oak fence and let's go ahead and count these blocks now the same thing right here is going to be down there on those three windows now when it comes to the windows here and the window here right at the entrance I don't think I'm gonna put curtains on it but let's go ahead and count these blocks here so right here I have one two three and then three here now this window is the same as this one here if you remember the middle one was a little bit bigger so this here is going to come down by three here again three here and then three here and then inside here is just going to be filling whatever it's going to come right down here to the bottom of the window and then 
this one here is going to be pretty much the same thing so right up top one two three four five across with that in the middle and this here is three coming down and then it's going to be two two and then two and then one right here to hold this powder up and then again this one here is the same as that one over there so do this right here the same thing right down here on these three windows as well All right now this is what you should have just like the other side and what I've done here is just carried this along the front here just like so now we will add a lot of detail later on so don't worry about all that now right here what we're gonna do for this wall we're gonna go ahead and take this bottom block here and this block here what have you guys used and then this is gonna come right here just like so all right now once you've got that then this here will come up over just like this and this here will be filled in and this will go all the way down right now for the arches itself we're gonna go ahead and replace the blocks here with the white concrete so this here all this will be replaced with it and again this will come across here and then up and over like that so right down here again the white concrete will be the arch itself all right now on this side right here this is what I've done now the other side is gonna be the same this is gonna just continue all the way down to the other end I didn't do this side here because I'm gonna show you how I done it right over here even though that it's very simple again it's all up to you guys how you do this I use the orange terracotta and also the yellow terracotta right here right here I went ahead and doubled this white concrete up on this arch and it goes down right here right over here the same thing so here it starts out with the orange and right over here it starts out with the orange it starts orange here and then it comes down here and it starts orange here again this here is two blocks the same and then this block here will come all the way down up and over so again this is very self-explanatory this is just going to be doubled up coming all the way across and when you get down here just go ahead and do that and then you'll do the same thing so it'll start out with orange or whatever block you're going to use so right down here it's gonna be like that a pattern kind of like this now like I said earlier buildings like this has weird uh, patterns and colors inside that will go all the way down and then this will be just like so alright now for the men's restroom it's gonna be pretty much the same as the women's the only thing different is the women's won't have urinals well because you should know women don't have the same plumbing as men okay so on the ceiling we have a block of quartz and that's because they look like tiled ceiling now the walls from here to the top is gonna to be seven blocks tall and I did get rid of the in rods we'll be doing lights in the ceiling so just pretty much do the same kind of layout for the women's restroom as I have here well, alright now let's go ahead and look at the lights what we're gonna be putting in the ceiling now the women's will be the same for the lights as well so if we come right in here in the entrance way we're gonna go ahead and count from this two blocks and then we're gonna have this two by two here now let's come up top so you can see it a little bit easier right here the lights again gonna be two by two and they're gonna be one two three blocks apart another two by two and then so on again these will be three blocks apart as you see and then you should end up with one block from here alright now what we're gonna do is come right over here to the left of this here is going to be one two three four and another two by two now these here will be the ones that's over the stalls 
And then these will be also three blocks apart for these two by twos. So just go ahead and do that all the way down. And then what we're going to do inside of here is we're just going to go ahead and put the uh, glass block of choice in here. And then right on top, go ahead and put your light source block, whatever you guys want to use on top. Once you have those lights there, then you're going to put more to the right of this, which will be over the sink. And right here, one, two, three, four, and then another two by two here. And then these here is going to be three blocks apart, just like what we've been doing. So right here will be another one, and then right here will be another one as well. Alright, now once you have the lights in here, it may still be a little bit dark in some areas like back here. So what I'm going to do, instead of adding more lights, I'm going to go ahead and take the light block. Now as you see, I went ahead and put the light block across here. Now if you have it too close to the mirror, which is ice, it will melt. Alright, so now I'm just going to go ahead and place it where it's needed. Now, if you don't have this in your hand, then you won't see it. So, you see, if I take it out of my hand, you can't see it. Just like so. So, nobody will ever know that these are here. So, just, again, place these where it's needed. Alright, now this is how the women's restroom is. It's pretty self-explanatory. Alright, so now let's go ahead and make our way out of here. And... As you see, I went ahead and took the white wool on across and closed this up. We're going to do the same thing on the men's as well. And also right down here, as you see, I have the purple wool as a border across the bottom and right over here as well. Just like so. Now right on the other side of this opening here, we'll have the purple here as well. And then this will come around just like so. This will be the food court. So it'll come around this way and continue just like this. Go ahead and take that all the way around to here and on the other side of this opening on this wall as well. This is the men's room. So the purple again right through here across the bottom and then right over here as well up against the wall. Just like that. Now once you've got that, then now take the white wool. The white wool will come right up here. We'll come right across this purple. Come straight on up. That'll be filled in there. Inside of here, the white wool will come across the top here. And this here will be filled in as well with that. And then right here as well, the white wool will come across, come on up, and this here will also be filled in with the white wool as well. Right here, this will come across this way. Again, this will be filled in. And then right here, all this as well will be filled in with the white wool coming straight on up just like that. And then this here as well. And then right in here. Alright everyone, I'm going to go ahead and end the video right here for part 2. Part 3, we will finish this build. Doing the walls. Doing the upstairs to this build. Doing the furniture and the food court and everything else inside of here. Please leave a like down below. Let me know what you think of this build so far. Thank you again for watching. And I'll see you in part 3.